What is prediabetes? Prediabetes is a condition in which your blood sugar levels increase, but not high enough to be classified as type 2 diabetes. Prediabetes affects one in three Americans, and 80% of those individuals are unaware of their condition. For this reason, today's discussion will focus on the early warning signs and symptoms of prediabetes. I'll also discuss how to reverse prediabetes using some very straightforward dietary changes and lifestyle changes. Who is at risk of prediabetes? Danger elements What you should know is that prediabetes happens when the body produces too much insulin. People who are overweight, especially in the belly and midsection, are more likely to have this blood sugar problem. Being over 45 also increases the risk. People who lead sedentary lifestyles and don't exercise at least three days a week are also more likely to have prediabetes and blood sugar problems. Women who have polycystic ovary syndrome are also more likely. Insulin resistance, the cause of prediabetes. Insulin resistance, which occurs when your cells stop accepting insulin and sugar, is what causes prediabetes and diabetes. It can be a genetic trait that is inherited from a parent, but most of the time it is brought on by eating too many refined carbohydrates and sugars in your diet. Prolonged mental and emotional stress can also cause insulin resistance. Ingesting excessive amounts of inflammatory vegetable oils, such as soy, cottonseed, canola, etc., can potentially cause prediabetes. Given that they are frequently employed in the manufacture of fast food, you can understand how they could harm your cells. Symptoms of prediabetes. Prediabetic symptoms of insulin resistance. Now that you are familiar with prediabetes, let's look at some common symptoms to look out for in your own body. Number one, dark patches of skin. One of the first symptoms of prediabetes is dark patches of skin. You may start noticing darker leathery skin appearing on the creases of your body, such as your neck, groin, or armpits. This occurs when your blood has higher levels of insulin and sugar than it should, which prompts your skin cells to grow quickly, resulting in thicker skin dot, and it also increases the secretion of melanin. The substance that gives these skin patches their darker and browner in color. Number 2. Blurred Vision When your blood sugar levels are higher than normal, your eyes lenses swell with fluid, which causes blurriness in your field of vision and can also lead to changes in the shape of your eyes, which may require glasses. This is another very common early sign of prediabetes. You may notice that when you're looking at something and then suddenly the room becomes blurry, this sugar can also harm the nerves in your eyes, a condition known as retinopathy. Number 3. Increased urination at night As I mentioned, number 3 is also very typical for people with diabetes and prediabetes. Increased urination at night can be a sign of insulin resistance because the extra sugar in your body retains water in and around your cells when you sleep. As a result, your kidneys have to work harder over time to remove this extra sugar from your blood, which makes you urinate more frequently. Number 4. Tingling Sensation or Numbness The fourth warning sign to look out for is an unusual tingling or numbness in your extremities. Higher than normal blood sugar levels can also harm the nerves, especially the ones that are farthest from your heart, like the hands and feet. This can occasionally cause a tingling, pins, and needles sensation, especially in the little toe or feet. All of these symptoms can be reversed by making changes to your diet and lifestyle, and we'll discuss this in more detail later in the video. Moving on to the next symptom. Number 5. Delayed Wound Healing Delayed wound healing higher levels of sugar in the blood also cause oxidative damage to your blood vessels, which can reduce the blood flow and oxygen supply, particularly to your skin, causing a cut, bruise, or wound to heal very slowly. Number 6. Feeling extremely thirsty Another sign of prediabetes is feeling extremely thirsty even after not eating anything salty. As I mentioned earlier, your kidneys work harder to filter out the excess sugar that's in your blood, and this is the defense strategy. Number 7. Sweet Cravings Next is excessive sweet cravings, which are also a sign of prediabetes. Although most people occasionally experience these cravings, 
those who have the condition are more likely to experience them on a daily basis. If you notice that you frequently crave sweets after meals, even when you're not hungry, this may indicate that you have some degree of insulin resistance. This is because your cells are refusing to respond to insulin, which leaves the extra sugar in your blood not providing enough fuel for your body. Number 8 Feelings of Anxiety Number 8 is a frequent source of brand new anxiety symptoms. Although some stress is healthy for the body, as long as it passes quickly, anxiety is a normal part of life. If, however, nothing has really changed in your life and you have started to feel nervous all of a sudden, especially within one to two hours of eating, this may be a sign of prediabetes or high blood sugars. You may also experience what they call hunger anger or being hungry when you don't eat because your blood sugars tend to fall faster because of the insulin resistance. Prediabetes affects the way neurons communicate in the brain, causing chemical changes that trigger feelings of fear and anxiety that come and go. Number 9 Clusters of Skin Tags Ninth Sign of Prediabetes New Clusters of Skin Tags Most people have a few skin tags here and there, but if you notice that you're developing more of these in a cluster, this could be a sign of prediabetes. High levels of insulin in the blood caused by prediabetes may be allowing a certain virus that typically lives in people to come out of remission called HPV, which can result in new skin tags and even may start showing up on some people's skin. Number 10. Excessive Fatigue Excessive fatigue is another very common indicator of prediabetes. If you are getting enough rest and sleep but still feel exhausted and fatigued, this may also be a sign of prediabetes. This is because uncontrollably rising or falling blood sugar levels deplete essential nutrients like vitamin B1, which causes fatigue and excessive fatigue. How to Reverse Prediabetes We'll now move on to the part on how to reverse prediabetes. 1. The main cause of prediabetes is typically eating too much sugar and processed carbohydrates. Therefore, you should start eliminating the sugar from your diet. The carbonated drinks, pastries, and bread and biscuits. Fruit liquids as well as cookies increase your consumption of whole foods, which will fuel your cells and help you control your blood sugar in substitute of these highly refined items. 2. Avocado, wild salmon, pastured meat, grass-fed veggies like carrots and tomatoes, and so on. These ought to be your selections. Chromium is a highly special trace mineral that helps insulin and glucose become more responsive in your body so that it can be taken out of your blood to reverse the condition. Take chromium picolinate daily at a dosage between 200 and 1,000 micrograms per day. Additionally, it aids in the production of glutathione by your liver, a powerful antioxidant that also has the ability to treat prediabetes. 3. You'll need to start making an effort to increase your activity and begin exercising. This doesn't have to be strenuous. Long walks are actually the best choice because they lower blood sugar levels and relieve stress, which is a factor in high blood sugars. I want to thank you again for watching this video 